From April 2016, there's a new tax charge coming into effect on dividends. This will be good news for some, but negative for others. There has been a lot of talk about the rule affecting owners of limited companies, which it will, but equally it will affect all shareholders. Perhaps an investor like you who receives dividend income from equities or from collective investments. Under the new rules, after you have utilised your personal allowance, and that should be £11,000 from April 2016, an individual will be able to receive up to £5,000 per year of dividend income with no tax liability at all. Thereafter, the government has introduced higher rates of tax on dividends. There's an extra 7.5% tax for basic rate taxpayers, an extra 32.5% for higher rate taxpayers, and a whopping 38.1% for the top rate. The new tax rules will have a big impact on business owners, primarily those who pay themselves in dividends. Let me talk about making pension contributions, which, as you probably know, are a legitimate business expense. And pensions are an incredibly tax-efficient investment. Currently, when you retire, you can take 25% of the pension fund as a tax-free lump sum. We would also like to hear from people who have a share portfolio or a portfolio of collective investments because there should be some valuable tax planning with which we can help you. Please contact us by telephone or use one of the links on our website.